So it's that boat here today. Uh, we're gonna talk about what happened. Uh, last April. I mean, it's April. You know what I mean? Last month. You, you know what I mean? Uh, but yeah. Um, let's get started. Uh, news that wasn't uh, you know, Sonic related or anything like that, or Sega related. Uh, well, um, well, the Nintendo Labo came out and. That did okay, I guess. I mean, I like it, and a lot of people did like it too. And I, I, I also think it's pretty great, to be honest. I wouldn't buy it, but I, I think it looks fun, to be honest, a bit. <laughs> but yeah. Anyway, yeah. Um, and there's like a new present for Nintendo also. Uh, with the other president that's retired. Ain't it really, he wasn't around for a while. I didn't really know him. Yeah. Okay, but yeah. Anyway, on to some Sonic news. Excuse me. Sorry. Um. Yeah. Uh. So the comments came out, and I really. And here's what I think. Here's what. Here's my kind of my review on it. Issue one was freaking amazing, my boy. Um. For first, for first issue, it was great. Sonic and Tails were working together, and it is aw It was awesome. Issue two, it was great too. Sonic and Amy were working together, freaking awesome. Issue three, it was probably it, it was a great one too. Introduced new two new characters, and Sonic and Knuckles were were fighting together, and there were two new villains, uh, um, Rough and Tumble. Um, and yeah, I really did enjoy it. Oh, and also, the hooligans, I guess, are canon. Yeah, they actually referenced the hooligans in issue 3. <laughs> uh, it was funny. <laughs> and the whisper can, too, I guess. But, uh, I don't really care. <laughs> Feel though? Yeah. Issue 4, probably the best out of all of them. And uh, I definitely say, waiting for issue 4 was totally worth it. It was one of the best. One, we have Blaze in it. My girl. And we have a new character that I already love. Uh, you know, um, what was the name again? Uh, t t Tangle, yeah. And it was freaking awesome. It just, it it was just so great. Anyway, yeah. Anyway, yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. That's really it. Um, for the news, I'm not very really sure what else it was. Oh, yeah, there was, uh, the Sonic Mania Plus trailer, and that one, and I freaking loved it. It was great. It kind of added on to the animation, uh, from the first trailer, kind of a bit. It was just freaking awesome. Um, and we also got some more news on the Sonic, on Sonic Mania Plus. Uh, Fine Battery, uh, well, first, um, Green Hill is looking, like, well, it's looking a lot more like Sunset Hill from Advance Free. <laughs> um, uh, Chemical Plant is gonna have nighttime. Uh, come. Uh, Studiopolis is, um, like, kind of at night. Like, if the lights were off. Uh, uh, what was another one? Um, uh, Stardust Speedway is gonna. Stardust Speedway is gonna be, like, uh, kind of a bit yellowish like it was like in the fall I guess kind of um and act two uh, and act, there's also act two of um of uh of um of press garden two which I think was like dark uh uh fine battery has like this sort of new like recall to it it looks like blue and a mix of um Yo, I think it's meant to reference uh uh Wing Fortress, which is awesome. Anyway, yeah. Um and the biggest news is uh a new zone is getting out. well kind of. It's like you can play uh it well um uh uh I'm trying to remember what his name was. Uh so you know um um Sonic social media manager, uh, um, well, he said that you can play, um, Angel Island for a bit, yeah, um, 
you know, it's a bit sad, but at the same time. But yeah, anyway, um, Mice Bill, and they also revealed Mice Billy. Mice Billy just like kind of dropped, kind of like in Forces or the new Modern Sonic games, which is really awesome. I like it. Uh, Ray is is basically like the it's like the um Wing Mario from Super Mario World. <laughs> I mean, it is really cool though. I, I like it. Oh, also Mirage Saloon is at night. Act two is, uh, and I think yeah, well, who knows. Anyway, yeah, and yeah, uh, and also there's like a there's also like a two team ability in here too, and that and that's really cool. And you can switch it. It's like Knuckles Chaotix, but without the y you go. I mean, it's really awesome. I love it. I'm I'm hyped for it definitely. Uh, uh episode one of the of the series of uh, Sonic Main Adventures came out. Uh. Like in the end of March, but I was like, unable to actually talk about it or update the video. So yeah, sorry about that. Um. Um. But yeah. Uh. And this one has the Sonic finding out that uh, well he returns back to um what the classic um place. At, I mean, I mean, you know, back to uh the past where he always was. Uh. After forces, because this takes place after forces. I think it's gonna probably lead up to um many uh, adventures. If it does, that's cool. Uh, and yeah, um, and yeah, uh. Anyway, yeah, and um, and Sonic discovers that Emma is trying to collect all the chaos emeralds, and yeah, and episode two. Featured tales and you, you know, um, and I, I love this one too. Both both these were great, um, and yeah, um, and Edman has this like drill machine, but Sonic and tails knock him knock it out, and Edman, I mean, and yeah, they find it in the chaos emerald. Well, they find two chaos emeralds actually. Um, I mean, I think Sonic already had one of them. Anyway, yeah, uh. And, yeah. Um, there was also, like, these ending parts, too, which kind of, like, clued you in. Like, for one, there was Metal Sonic appeared in the, in the ending of episode one. I mean, you don't actually see his face, but you know it's Metal Sonic. It's, like, in this wood, and it's, like, in the woods where, like, it's wood, it, like, trees are damaged. Uh, in episode two, you actually, ha you have a longer scene. It's, like, Ant-Man, like, discovering that, no that Knuckles is near, and he's carrying the Master Emerald. And yeah, that's not a good sign. We we call it the death egg, my boys. If if we do have death egg, and I'm um, Sonic Plus, I will scream. I'm sorry, so, um, death egg Sonic and Knuckles edition is the best zone of all time, in my opinion. But yeah, um, let's talk about the mods now. Um, and the mods, uh, uh, and the mods, uh, there's carnival, there's carnival night demo. Act one is complete. But Act 2 is, uh, I think, incomplete? I'm not sure. Uh, there was also these, uh, Sonic 3 special stage, I mean, bonus stages, which I was really happy they had. And this was actually in March, but then it was got, then it got updated in April, and I was unable to cover it when it was in March. So I couldn't update it, so you, you know what I mean. Uh, and, yeah. And, yeah. Um. Besides that, it's really, yeah, I think, um. There's also the modern Sonic mod, and... Aptos, uh, Aptos Windmill Isle, um, from Sonic Unleashed, and I think it was like a mobile version, or some fan game or something like that. But to be honest, it was great, and, um, Maranzan doesn't really actually boost, he just, like, kind of speeds up a bit, I kind of like it, but, it reminds me of when he speeds up in advance too, but that was more automatic than, uh, button, button control, but, to be honest, this is, like, really sick to see, to see it, um, there's also, uh, the pout swaps for Green Hill and uh and Chemical Plant, the Sonic Mania Adventures. I mean Sonic Mania uh, Plus versions of them. And yeah, I like that too. Um and yeah. Uh one more uh, there's also Radical Highway and um oh what was the R one? And uh and um Sea Escape. That was in 
that was also added. And I really love the remixes for it. It's really great. But yeah. Anyway, guys, that's the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you do, please like, subscribe, and I'm out here.